Behind us are a group of absolutely wonderful 8th and 9th graders painting murals that reflect the children of the parents that we serve at Echoes. It's exciting. We serve a lot of immigrants. We serve a lot of refugees. We serve children from all over the world with their families. And these murals will, represent, will be representative of that. And I am thrilled beyond belief to have this done. Art Angels is the Healing Arts Network from MOCA and our role with MOCA is to be able to use volunteerism and creative philanthropy to promote social wellness. So what we feel is that you know art is very healing and that volunteerism is an opportunity for folks to get out and have a creative experience and in this instance these students that otherwise may not have known about ECHOS and what they do are now aware of that. So ECHOS actually pointed out being able to use uh, Yes Prep as a, um, as a conduit to be able to fulfill this mural project because they thought it'd be great to get that kind of community inclusion. You know, we have five different values here at Braze Oaks and one of the values that we you know, really hold dear is community. Um, and our students, we want them to understand that you know, we're all working together. We're all you know, part of a greater community. Echoes is in the midst of you know, the Braze Oaks community and that's, you know, this is an organization that may, many of our students may have already gone through, some of their family members may have gone through. We want, uh, want them to really feel a connection to this community and a way to give back. So we try to give them you know, as much as possible, give them different opportunities here at the school, but we also want them to realize that it's not just about getting these opportunities and receiving them, but about giving them back and you know, helping others and really um, tying themselves into their communities. Oh, basically in this art, about uh, this kid and we're showing it in different tones of colors. It helps both the community and me because I need hours to do this so it feels really... I choose to spend my time here because I enjoy what MOCA is doing, doing for the community. I um, love being around children and the impact that they're making on our, on our city as far as contributing, giving back. To our community. My daughter is Maya White. I feel it's important to get her involved in the community. Having her exposed to the arts and I think MOCA is an outstanding organization. This work is very important because it's really in alignment with what MOCA does and we really have a strong community engagement component. It's culturally diverse so we welcome that and we embrace that.